Hi guys, I'm back again with another video talking about our latest product, the Ceramic Guard. Now before we get into the actual video, I wanted to tell you a quick story about what it took us to deliver this product to you guys. We actually wanted to start ShineX Pro with this product, but it was taking us way too long to be able to get it right. And in that process, we ended up launching 20 plus other products before we were able to crack that right formulation. Honestly, it took us two plus years and 100 plus trials before we were able to crack the right formulation, which could deliver the quality that we want you guys to experience. We've worked with seven plus different automotive chemical engineers from around the world. And once we had the formulation right, we tried to manufacture it in India, but due to issues with sourcing the right raw material, it just wasn't possible. We finally had to manufacture it in Europe and you guys know, when it comes to cars, the Europeans have got it all figured out. This product meets all the European and American standards, so you can be absolutely rest assured when it comes to quality. Now I know you guys love ceramic coatings, but why don't we get it done? Because traditional ceramic coatings have a few issues and we wanted to solve these with our product, the Ceramic Guard. Traditional ceramic coatings are super expensive. We decided to price the Ceramic Guard at an affordable price of $9.99 which is inclusive of taxes. In the package, you get two free microfiber cloths because we wanted to ensure that you have everything to get the job done. The second issue is that traditional ceramic coating needs professionals to get it done right. So that's why we designed a ceramic guard to be so easy that just a normal user can do it at the comfort of his home without the need of any special tools. Third, the entire process of a traditional ceramic coating takes anywhere from three to four days, out of which a good chunk, 24 to 48 hours, is just for the cure time. That's why we designed the ceramic guard so that it only needs about five to 10 minutes of cure time. Now I know what you guys are thinking. What's the catch? There is no catch guys. Each coating can easily last you four to six months. And to make sure that you guys get the best bang for the buck, one bottle, one 250ml bottle is enough to coat three standard sized cars. And it does not take too long. You'll probably take 20 minutes to coat a standard sized car and five to 10 minutes to coat a bike. Next, let's talk about how to apply the ceramic coating the right way. It's a fairly straightforward process. First, give your vehicle a thorough foam wash using our bubble wash snow foam shampoo. You can use our wash mitt to give it a contact wash to remove any surface contaminants. Afterwards, just rinse it with water and use one of our microfiber drying towels to dry your vehicle completely. You can either use our Sucker Extreme 600 GSM or our Pure Magic 1100 GSM to dry it off. If you want to go a step further, you can use a clay bar and clay down your entire vehicle using a clay lubricant. But make sure that your clay lubricant does not have wax in it. Once you're done claying it down, rinse it again with water and dry it off with our microfiber drying towels. Now, your vehicle is all set to be coated. We include two microfiber towels. One we're gonna call the coating microfiber towel and the other one is the buffing microfiber towel. Next, spray the ceramic guard a couple of times on the coating microfiber towel and also on the panel that you're trying to coat. Using the coating microfiber towel, spread the product evenly first in an up and down fashion, and then second, a right to left motion. This is what we call a cross hash pattern, which helps ensure that your entire surface is coated evenly and no part is left uncoated. Using the second buffing towel, buff the entire surface. Something to note here, the more you buff, the more the shine. Now a few things to keep in mind. Make sure to work in small sections and one panel at a time. What I mean by that is make sure that for a small section, you complete both the steps before you move on to the next panel or the next section. This is very important. And second, do not work in direct sunlight. The surface that you're trying to coat should be absolutely cool and not hot at all. So that means even if you've got the in engine turned on a few minutes before, that might also make the surface hot. So make sure that your surface is absolutely cool before you start working on it. In our last video, you have requested that we will make a video in Hindi. 
तो ये पूरा वीडियो हिंदी में देखने के लिए नीचे दिए हुए लिंक पे क्लिक करके आप वो वीडियो देख सकते हैं